Hey, what's up everyone? It's me, Compass, and today I'll tell you how you can start PvP with no membership. So, of course, um, you have to be level 21. So, the PvP you will be doing will be level 21 PvP. And, of course, that's a really good uh, level to start doing PvP at. But, uh, all the free areas and just a couple side quests combined um, will get you to about level 8 or level 9. And just to be safe, let's just say level 8. And of course, you know, you have to level up to level 21 somehow. Uh, but of course, you can by this one simple thing. Now, here's when it gets a little weird. So basically, to get to level 21, you have to do housing gauntlets. Sadly, you cannot port to someone, like some random person's house, or do this, uh, you know, go into a random castle from this castle place and just hit the dungeons. Uh, because King's Isles update. A little while ago made it so you cannot do those unless you are friends with the owner so once you are friends with the owner you can do any housing uh, gauntlet you want uh, it, you can just hit up a max somewhere there the thing is how you're probably gonna get you know just even access to the housing gauntlets uh, will be kind of difficult let me let me just say this right now all you have to do is just go into some sort of popular realm and just ask around like just you know say oh can I do some housing gauntlets with anyone uh, there are some people that are gonna charge you if they do try to charge you just you know drop it look for another person because there's a bunch of kind people that are playing this game and they will help you uh, though it may take a little while before you find someone I'll put a list of all the housing gauntlets right on the screen uh, and I'll probably put them all in the description or I'll just make some sort of doc or something like that uh, But yeah, so just make sure do enough to get you to level 21 and stay at level 21 uh, Because level, level 21 I think it's like where a lot of uh, adepts actually queue So you know you'll get matches much quicker I believe uh, But enough talking about that let's get on to the PvP Well hold your horses I do not recommend you PvP yet Low level PvP is completely filled with pay to win players. Uh, if I can t say something, and a lot of other low level PvP players, they can say for sure low level PvP is completely pay to win, but you can still win without paying any money. So don't let that disinterest you and like not doing PvP anymore for low level or just completely quit the game. Still play the game. Uh, it is pay to win, but there are still strats you can do. Uh, that do not require any pay to win items. It just makes it a lot harder to pull off But of course uh, my ramblings do not matter right now One thing I do recommend your starter pet that you get from Penny Dreadful uh, after you do the oldie town quest uh, Use that make that adult because you're gonna get a lot of mega snacks and a lot of gold from those housing gauntlets and one thing I do recommend you do is auto farm or not auto farm just respawn uh, that winter tusk boss. I forgot his name. I'll show him up right here uh, But you can respawn him. There's a respawn glitch and I'll probably put a link in the description if there is a video on it uh, But basically just keep doing that until you get a decent amount of those mega snacks then just come over here and get your uh, Your crappy starter pet and just you know train it up to adult So the reason you're training it up to adult is basically you can hatch with other pets in the game uh, Like say found spirit, right? I like your pet I want this pet. I want to use it for PvP. I'm gonna message you uh, and you know ask for a lend. Uh, what a lend basically is is um, the other player gets rewarded for giving you their pet. It does not uh, you know cost them any like sort of uh, gold or anything to hatch. It's just gonna cost you gold. Uh, so it actually helps them out, but they do have a limited amount of lends. Uh, so of course, if they are out, they are out. They're most likely not gonna use their actual ha hatch on you because you know they don't gain anything. Um, but Another thing you can do, uh, because these hatches will normally cost around 46000 to like 50000 I believe. Um, but if you do not want to spend that much, there is one thing you can do, but I do not recommend. So, of course, low level. Low level is very interesting because, um, you know, uh, the pets, you can be a warlord with a level, like an epic pet, right? You just gotta play weird, um, but you can even be a warlord with a fail pet at low level. So, like, 
what I do kind of, you know, if, if you really want to save your gold, I do not recommend you do this, but you could do this. You can go in the kiosk and just look for a pet you want, right? Like, say I want this amber golem or something, right? Browse it by type. Holy crap, 100k. I don't want to spend 100k. Who wants to spend 100k on a hatch? Not me, maybe. But um, what you can do, you can press previous pet, and it brings it down to 20,000, but it only has two talents in pool. But look at that. You know, just try to find one that is 2.0, something that has above 250 strength and 250. 55 will I believe uh, so that should be maybe fake nine uh, so it's you know max stat just get something like this right spell proof spell defy and I believe there's some fire things in there if you're fire just choose something you like do that look for something it's 20,000 per um, the uh, hatch uh, do I recommend you do that no if you're really cheap on gold you should you, all by all means you, you could do it uh, you could be probably a sergeant or a knight with a type of pet like that I'm gonna be honest uh, but that is one thing you can do and of course just keep on training pets uh, Just make the best pet you can because of course uh, without couch potatoes without all those mega snacks without ease Pets will be a lot harder to get and if I, with all honesty I believe you're gonna get your perfect pet probably in your first month So definitely it will take a while you could get that uh, probably a bit e or earlier but and uh, if, if I'm being real uh, not lying at all or just you know not sugarcoating it uh yeah it will take a little while but you can still stick with a fail pet or not even a uh, full-on mega pet in pvp because low level is just you know it, it, you can you can run you can run an epic pet now as soon as you you know just make some sort of pet that you can use uh of course you don't even need to make the pet you can straight up just play pvp uh what you can do is go up in the tourneys and just sign up for attorneys like, are the, like see this Arthur one v ones or Quick Match one v ones or all these. There's a bunch of one v ones and they're all on like different times of the day. This is Central Time, by the way. I believe all these are Central Time, so uh, you know just make sure the time right there is correct to yours. I'm not sure if uh, it's different for you guys because I live in Central. Uh, I believe this is always gonna be set to Central, but I may be really wrong. Uh, but what I do recommend you just go directly only. 1v1s, 2v2s do get very toxic at low level. Uh, reason why is just a bunch of deaths that just jade and they think they're funny. Uh, or they, you know, they think they're having a lot of fun. But they really aren't. But just do all these 1v1s. Um, and you're going to rack up a lot of tickets. Now, arena tickets. Uh, what should you do with those? Basically, just go to Branded Mistboard right outside the um, arena. And there are two things you can get. Basically, you can get some energy gear and it does not have a level uh, sort of, uh, you know, cap. You know, there's no recommended or recommended, sorry. There is no specific level you can use this at. You can lose, use this at any level. Um, so basically, only get the orange one. It's called Seafar Overcoats, the Seafar Closh, and the Seafar Galoshes. And they're very, very cheap. You can get them all in like an, uh, if there's like, I believe you mean like two quick or two quick matches. You can get them all. They're very very cheap, um, and the reason you should get this is that it gives you a decent amount of energy, so you can actually train up your pet way uh, quicker. Uh, another thing you need desperately is the duelist gear for level twenty. This stuff is really really good. Actually, crazy enough. Um, this is actually the best PvP gear you can get for free without, uh, you know, any of the other higher ranked, um, sort of, um, you know, PvP gear. So, of course, only, remember, get level 20 because you're level 21. Uh, the, you know, second highest is level 30, so get level 20. Uh, choose a color you like, right? And then just buy it. These are a lot of tickets, though. So this is a 15,000 tickets. This one is 35,000 tickets. This one, 15,000 tickets. There are a lot of tickets. Um, but yeah, th you know, there's, there's just a lot. There's definitely a lot. Now, low-level PvP, uh, it's mainly, uh, you know, decathlon heavy. And what I mean by that is everyone uses a decathlon. You're probably asking, what is a decathlon? So it is a deck that gives you stats and it gives you a pip very very useful for a low level because getting the extra pip can even win you that match it gives you some extra damage extra health 
uh, even some flat resist which is very very useful so you can like run it uh, and the thing about it is you can't use any main deck spells and that is fine the reason that is fine is because you're level 20 and many of the low you know uh, main deck stuff you don't really need because you can pack in your side so you can have a side deck uh, you can like pack, pack specific things in here and you know just just run something yeah but this is definitely enough to kill someone if they're jaded then you know that's rough but um, this is definitely enough to kill someone right like this is enough you can do a neat strat uh, but I do recommend you do decathlon and the thing is uh, decathlon is every uh, probably month I'm not too sure but it is uh, it comes out every now and then uh, in the sort of event and it is free but you can most likely only get rank 2 or rank 3 if you really really get lucky um, without a good healing pet if you do somehow get a uh, self or some sort of uh, healing pet, uh, talent on one of your pets then you're, you're, you're kind of chilling but um, it is definitely really hard but as soon as that decathlon comes out just hop right into there, get a bunch of treasure cards from the shop. You should have a lot of gold from those, uh, you know, uh, what do you call them? Um, those housing gauntlet runs and, you know, just run something and, you know, just, you know, just be neat. Just be neat. I believe uh, there are some sort of uh, guides on how to do decathlon, so I'll put those in the description as well. Uh, and, uh, you know, just please check them out. Of course, you really don't need Decathlon. You can run any deck and you can still win. Uh, but of course, uh, as soon as you get all your gear, get a decent pet, just hop and rank, you know, and basically you're set. Yeah, that's seriously all you need to do for PvP. Um, just, it's very, very simple. Like, yeah, there's like a couple duelist stuff, you know, get all the level 20 stuff uh, for duelist. There's sockets, you can just get them from uh, Jordo over here. Uh, but you know, this is definitely a very, very, uh, you know, neat thing King's Isle did. Uh, I actually really appreciate that King's Isle did, um, you make PvP free, uh, even though there is definitely the boosting problem. Uh, but, uh, I don't think it's really as relevant as the game kind of like, you know, being more popular, uh, as it is. Uh, but the thing is, uh, I really want you guys to know that, uh, PvP is pay to win, but you can still win and um, Honestly, the satisfaction of you beating a pay to win player as a free to play player is just uh, Astonishing, it's just amazing it feels amazing uh, And but thank you guys for watching if you have any questions, please uh, leave them down in the comments uh, below and yeah I'll see you guys in the next video